Hi there, collective. I'm back again. So I pulled some more cards and we got come together. So the fairies are encouraging us all to come together because many hands make our job easier and lighter. And then we got the fairy queen of light comes to shed love and light onto your current situation and to remind you that light can penetrate the darkness. So our powers are growing. Oh, nature signs. <laughs> Be receptive to the subtle changes from nature as you go about your day. Nature calls to us continually. We need only open our hearts and minds. Right? And then we got fire spirit, starry night, and earth spirit, pegasus spirit, and aspen spirit. So we're being encouraged to use our courage use our courage have courage acceptance accept the truth the reality right and we got energize you can tap into the energies of the earth so go outside and open your hands to receive more blessings you're looking for stability right stability all around stability and acceptance because you're transcending you're not putting up with the bullshit anymore and anything sent your way is already caught by God and taken care of you are protected you and your loved ones whether that be your your children or your fur babies they are protected at this time and whatever is being put out to cast harm returns to sender immediately so know that you are protected. Your family is protected. Your marriage is safe. And we got Ishtar as boundaries. People need to learn how to keep their boundaries. And stop interfering with the cycle of life. And God's plan for you. That's important to know. Mind your boundaries. The energy harvesting, right? You know what to do. It stops today. There will be no more energy harvesting off you. Keep saying your protection prayers. Don't allow people to steal your, your peace. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying. God's saying. Spirit's saying. Ask God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit to please come in and use me as your vessel. Bless my throat chakra to speak my truth. What does the collective need to know? Ooh. Epidote. It's the crystal. What it is. Epidote is a prismatic earth green aluminum silicone mineral. It's the get what you give a stone. <laughs> Making good vibes even better, but be warned, if you bring epidote into your world, be ready to bring it. If you're set on wallowing out, keep epidote at a safe distance. Who needs it? Anyone putting in the work on their self. Where to put it? Stashed away with your essential to-do list. When to use it? When you're looking to kick a bad habit, a bad friend, or a bad mood. When you want to cast a spotlight on your weaknesses so you can work on them. It's called upgrade your version of you. So you are upgrading. That's the transcending card on your Pegasus. You let your wings out. Look, you play amongst the stars. Yeah, that's beautiful. That's card number 28. Oh, the numbers. Starry Night and Earth Spirit were 4114. So that angel number could signify something to you. Or angel 5-5, five, five, which goes to a 10. And Fire Spirit is a 17, which goes to an 8. And the Aspen Spirit Courage is a 3. And I think that's it that we have for numbers. Let's see what the runes have to say. 
What room? I'll pull three rooms. Please clarify this reading for us. What do we need to know? God's children, the angels, light workers, star seeds, the good ones, the good angels. Not for karmics and not for fallen angels. Keep praying over people. That's what I just kept hearing. We got Pethro. Uncertain meaning, a secret matter, a mystery, hidden things and occult abilities. Initiation, knowledge of one's destiny, knowledge of future matters and determining the future of your path. So you know all this, right? Your relationship with God is very special. He shares things with you. Things that are private, meant to be kept to yourself sometimes. Rado, travel. We had travel in the first reading. Both in physical terms and those in lifestyle direction. So it could be metaphysical as well. Spiritual, ether, galaxies. Relocation, evolution, amen, amen. Change of place or setting and seeing a larger perspective. So you are woke up, you're awake, you see everything. <laughs> That's scary. You can choose to turn that off. You don't need to see people showering or shitting or having sex or whatever. That's too much interference and that breaking spiritual laws people have privacy so I'm being told to tell you to mind your business honor justice leadership and authority analysis rationality knowing where one's true strengths lie and the willingness to self-sacrifice oh, well then that's a character description or what self-sacrifice without dying that's a nice way to live that's a nice way to live oh mm. how about a good word card a good word card it's important keep up your prayers read your bibles god will guide you to the right scripture always that's meant for you not necessarily made for everybody else so that's why your relationship with God is special and precious, unique, authentic. What does the collective need to know? Oh, he says in Matthew chapter 6, verse 34, Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. Isn't that the truth? So know that you are taken care of, you're provided for. God is showering, showering provisions upon you and blessings. And he is sending people to help you. Be thankful, be gratitude, show gratitude. You could be being encouraged to start a GoFundMe account for, so that you can accept donations from all over the world. Gets more places. People are willing to help you. That was specific message. That was a specific message. Let's see. We'll go with the mystical wisdom oracle. So know that anybody, any of your enemies coming up against you, you, the listener, you are protected. They can't hurt you anymore. You're being told and guided to walk away from people you know that have hurt you in the past because they're still continually hurting you. They could be publicly shaming you or embarrassing you. Pay no attention to it. Knowledge. You may need to seek knowledge. I'll pull a couple more cards. Pay attention to where you're being guided. The people that you're being directed to are meant to cross you on your path. 
We got Battle of the Blues, Take Steps Towards a Positive Change. Yes, you can do this. You may be being encouraged to go and have that spiritual cleansing bath finally. Let it all out. Cry it all out. Forgive those that hurt you. Oh, that, that was cool. Good fortune awaits you. You just need to invite the magic into your home, to your heart, to your mind. There's that rainbow again. That's God's promise. God's promise. He's pouring his blessings out to you. And the dragonfly, live free. Live free and live your life to the fullest. Right? You got the dragonfly spirit. Yeah. Is that? Yeah, it looks like a dragonfly. So get out in nature today. Go out and smell the roses. Thank you, Collective. I'm being called to end this reading for now. Yes? Oh, my bad. Angel cars. Mm. That might be significant for you. You could be feeling this way. Being pulled apart. Cut the cords of attachment today and only allow love and light anywhere near you. It's important to protect yourself, people. And the grandmother of Jesus, you're seeding the light, laying foundations in the divine plan. So, back to the Bible, as many protection prayers that you can say. So, the book tells us how to live, the book tells us how to survive and thrive, and the book teaches us how to protect ourselves. Being told to cancel. No need to worry. Cancel. Cancel. You may want to cancel a subscription that you're paying money to for no reason. So there's no need to worry. And within the next few months, things were not going to seem the same as they were. Great changes, great changes. Because you're lifting up your energy. You're protecting yourself. You figured out where all the energy harvesting was coming from. And, um, yeah. Everybody's, everything's coming together. Protect yourself. Listen to the guidance from your father. And your energy. Pay attention to your energy. Because they're trying to tell you something. Your spirit guides. Your ancestors, your loved ones, you are loved, you're protected, you're already whole and complete. God bless you, Collective. I'll see you in my next upload.